Hello everyone, this is Christopher Carrington with GMUstudent.com and today we're going to learn how to make skip links on our web page. These are basically when you see on a website it will say like go to top of the page and you click it and it will immediately shuffle you to the top of the page. Or you can see a link that will say go to content and it will take you down and it will skip a whole bunch of stuff and it will go to the content that you really care about. If you're interested in making these, I'll show you how to do it right now. So the first thing we're going to do is let's open up Dreamweaver create a new HTML and let's save it so let's go file save as and let's call it skip underscore link and click save so now we have our web page let's make sure everyone is in designer view and that we're in design view of designer view so everybody's is looking the same as mine so let's make our links first by typing in go to content and click enter four times and then type in content so basically what we're going to do is our user is going to be able to click go to content and they're going to come down to here where it says content. In order to do that, click right before wherever you want the person to be shuffled down to and go to your insert common panel. Let's move this down a little bit and you're going to insert a named anchor. This is how you make the skip link. So click named anchor, give it a name, so let's call it skip, click OK and now you have made your named anchor where your skip link is going to be. So now highlight whatever you want your user to click in order to go there. So let's click the go to content, highlight that, and click your point to file in your properties panel of HTML, click it, and drag it to that named anchor and let go. Now you will see this just highlighted blue, It now it's a link. So when the user clicks this, they will go to the content section. Don't believe me, let's check it out previewed in Safari, now something weird is going to happen. We're going to click go to content and nothing is going to happen. That doesn't mean the skip link didn't work, that just means that this web page isn't big enough to move down. As you can see we have no scroll bar here so how on earth is the web page going to move down if there's no content down here? If you don't understand what I'm talking about, just go to your end of where your content is and let's click enter like 15 times. Just a whole bunch of times until you really can't see anything anymore. And now let's preview it in Safari. Save all your changes. And now you will see that we have a little scroll bar. So when we click go to content, it actually scrolls down the page and it goes to the content. That's something that a lot of people will make their named anchors correctly, but then they'll say they're not working. That's why they're not working. Your web page just isn't big enough. So now you've learned how to make your skip links. And I hope this tutorial was useful. This has been Christopher Carrington with GMUstudent.com. And thank you for watching.